Hey guys, so today I'll be showing you guys how to draw. So, um, I'll be showing you guys how to draw something. I don't know why, but we're going to draw. So, make sure first you have this app, which is called iArtBook. iArtBook. So, it's called iArtBook. So, make sure you have it. Or you can also have iVisus Paint. But I recommend having the iArtBook at this better and it only works on Apple, so, or Samsung, I don't know, but, yeah, it's free, so, you don't have to do anything, so, click on it, sorry about that, I was doing something, but, yeah, we have all these drawings, so, today, I'll be showing you guys how to draw, uh, 3D, how, so, you can also click new image, and click whatever canvas size you want, I'm gonna be doing the square, because I always do the square, when I do here, now, it's just the music, but click square if you want to. So we're gonna have this. Just here. So you're gonna want to make the size 132. No. Uh huh. 126 or 27. And to lower down, you just do that. Oh, this is with a obesity. I don't know how you say it. But yeah. Uh, so once you have your size, you want to get whatever color you want from here, or you could go here. And if you have this, I think this is where you start with. So you just go down here and click this to get the circle thing, and you know to get whatever random color you want. So I'll be doing purple. So make sure you have your color, your color that you're gonna use, or you can make whatever color. And you're gonna be using black too. So first, you're gonna want to get and make sure you're on your brush that is called glossy and click the 50% calligraphy or whatever, which, whichever one you want. But make sure it's on glossy because I don't know what happened to my to this to my this. So to oh by the way to erase if you don't want to have to click up here to the eraser and start erasing everything all you have to do is just double tap that and it'll erase so um well I'll see okay so um the heck okay um some uh, how many ads are there so guide your um color and draw a regular um heart just a heart or whatever you're gonna do I recommend doing a heart so we're gonna do be showing us how to draw a heart so I'll be right back when I'm done drawing the heart it doesn't have to be perfect but this is what I do it doesn't have to be perfect so make sure you're still on the color or if you got another color what you're gonna do is just zoom in into that color and just um, and just unclick this thingy this thingy so click on it and then this will show up and you just put it to the color and do that and it's gonna say select the color and just drag this all the way here to the color and if it says use buggy tool just click it yes and it will fill it all up and erase something oh god let me raise something real quick you guys Okay, so sorry, it had a little bump right here, so I raised it. But now, what you're gonna do is you're gonna want to click right here where the hardest shape is. I click on it and click the plus sign because these are the layers. So if you click on another one, it's gonna say all of this and all of that. And if you double tap, you're gonna do that. But make sure you don't do nothing to that. So, what you're gonna do. Is you're gonna to um you're gonna want to um click the oh by the way to um duplicate it you just have to click this and to erase one you just have to do that so um what we're gonna do is we're gonna click this plus sign plus sign and then you're gonna have a layer two so you're going to hold the layer the layer two and drag it like that so the layer one which is the heart is gonna go up like that make sure you do it like that 
Next, go on your colors right here and make sure it's gray now and it doesn't have to heart. If it has to heart, make sure you do that step, which is um, that step that is um, to doing this. So just click the plus sign. Oh god, click the plus sign and just hold it down and drag it under like that. So next, go on your colors. Make sure you don't have the heart again. I repeat, you do not have the heart. Get your black color, or you could just make it by doing this. Look, get your black black color. And once you have your black color, you're gonna see that you're not gonna be able to draw on top of it. So that's what you're gonna want to have. So make your size kind of bigger. So make it probably to 123. No, actually, 162 the size. And just outline it like that. So uh, just, I'm gonna try to do it with one hand. So by the way, you can do it at whatever size you want the heart. So so once you have it outlined and you make and you know how much you wanted it. So next we're gonna do is you're gonna have these three dots. So click um wait, what is it? So click FX FX, click on it. And if you already have it right there, I mean it looks like that. That the FX. So click on it and it's gonna if you do this, it's gonna do that. So it's the blurring thing. So you're gonna want to blur it to to 37.2 percent, and next click apply. Max, you're gonna want to with the black again. You're gonna want to add a layer. So to add a layer, make sure you're on layer two. Click the plus sign. Click the plus sign. So I click the plus sign. Now you're gonna get black and make sure you have this too. So to add that, you just go the same thing, the three little dots, and click shapes. So once you have shapes, all you're gonna do is you're just gonna draw an oval, and it's gonna make a perfect oval. And just you can size it at whatever you want. So pretend. So that's it. I wanna write here. And to make it bigger, if you accidentally did something, you just do that. So, let's say you want to write here. And you can move it. So. Um, I want to write here. Let's make it smaller. Right there. Once you have that, go to the little brush right here. Um, Next, just make sure you're on black. Just drag, oh god. Just drag the black to the circle and click yes and it's gonna just do that so you're gonna do the same thing as you did for the outline part click the filter thing and blur it to 62.4 percent it's gonna look like that click apply and then you're done doing your heart so yeah i really hope you guys enjoyed and you can do whatever random stuff you want so yeah you can do whatever random stuff you want you can color it you can do like poke it out so i'm gonna go ahead and decorate it so i'll be right back so if you're doing this make sure you don't get the shadow because it's gonna look like that so don't do that and try not to get any of the shadow black thing if you do, it's okay. You just have to get a little bit, a tiny bit. So, yeah. You don't have to do this part. So, I'm gonna... So, if you wanna delete it, you just do that. Make sure you're only on the layer of the little circle thing if you don't want it, you just do that. So, I deleted it because I didn't want it, but... Because I wanted to clip it. So... Yeah. I'm going ahead and color it. 
So once I now I have it, so now I'm just gonna blur it. You don't have to blur it, but I wanna blur it. So just that apply, and then you have your hearts, and you can keep decorating. But yeah, this is how I want it. Oh god, this is how I want it. So yeah, really hope you guys enjoyed it. So to to save it, you just click the X. And then it's gonna show up, so click it. And if you wanna name it, you just put whatever thing you want. So I'll just put a code. That's the code. I could just put whatever random things, or you can only name it. And then it will show. So like this says, "Don't touch my iPad." And you wanna rename it to "Don't touch my iPad." I just click. I just do "Don't." My iPad. So I have it. Click OK and it'll change it. See? So don't touch my iPad. So yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. So if you guys did, make sure you give it a big thumbs up and I hope you guys really like it. So yeah, bye!